Alrighty. G'day guys. How's it going? Welcome back to the stream. Hope you had a good weekend. We're going to be playing some Oxygen Not Included today. It has been a little while since I've opened this game. Besides checking out the skins. Um, we're due for a run. It's uh, long overdue in fact. I've been talking about wanting to play this game for a long time now. Wanting to give it a proper shot. And I know it sounds like something that I might have said in the past. But I think we will do it this time. I genuinely do. Um, but yeah, how are you guys doing? G'day Nora Nix. How's it going? Confused? Parade? Welcome guys. Um, six mods may be out of date, apparently. Well, update them then. <laughs> um, what? What is... why? <laughs> Just update them, game. What do you want from me? Yeah, I'm doing alright today. Doing okay. Been having some internet issues again, but it seems alright for the moment. G'day, Marine. Hey, Log1. G'day Guav. And I'll give you guys the chance to join in on the colony as well when we get it up and running. Alright. Um, do we have visual? We have visual, yes. I did switch internet, yeah. So that just tells me that the problem is not the ISP, it's just the internet itself, <laughs> which is not good. Um, so how can it be enabled if it's out of date? I don't understand. Update six mods which appear to be out of date. I don't get it. I guess you don't need pliers anymore because they did that in the game. Mod updater <laughs> is out of date. Um, maybe I'll just uh, disable what is this build over plants. Okay, that's good that that works. I need my blueprints. Maybe I'll finally learn how this game works. Maybe I will too. <laughs> we'll learn together. Whatever, we'll just... Let's hope for the best. Okay, fine. I've played like almost 300 hours of this game. I'm at like 280. But the vast majority of that was like when the game was new-ish. So... I... I suck at... Everything beyond, like, automation, I'm no good at, including automation. <laughs> so, you know, setting up all of those wires and uh, readers and not gates or gates, no good. Um, space, no good. Um, Everything in the DLC, I don't think I've I've hardly touched any of that stuff beyond just like going to a new asteroid. Um, what else was there that's new? There's there's I haven't played this game for like a year, so anything that has been added in that time, I don't even know of. Um, nuclear reactions and stuff. I have no idea what that's about. You know, I kind of want to see what my my previous when the okay there we go my previous colony looked like. Two hundred and eighty cycles in. That's kind of weird. Wait, hold on. I've played exactly two hundred and eighty hours 
of this game. And I finished on cycle 280? What is that? That's strange. <laughs> we'll see. Um, just so I can look at what mistakes I made and not do them again. <laughs> Just to check out true tiles it makes the tiles look much better. I'm gonna have to check out a lot of mods, I guess. I I still think I'll leave it relatively vanilla for this run though, because I'm still trying to learn the game. Albeit, I mean that's just a visual mod, so it doesn't make too much difference. But yeah. If you have like really good mods that you would recommend. I guess you can chuck them in the Discord. Why, game? Why? Uh... <laughs> um, any mods that could be related to this error have been unchecked. Well then, what do you want? <laughs> what do you want from me then? this be on YouTube? It might be on YouTube. It could be. I, I'm i still madly going through my um, recordings for the DST series. I'm like 50% through. So I'm up to about episode, oh not episode, um, stream 15 out of 28 or something like that. So I'm basically halfway. But yeah, hopefully I, I'm at the point where I need to edit, otherwise I have no space to stream. <laughs> like, I can't create any more footage unless I edit <laughs> and, and get rid of the footage I had. Can we try it again? Oh, we have this too. Cantaloupe, colony. Cycle 69. Great. This one didn't last long. What were the ones that... System lasted 279 days. Was that the most recent one? Potato in the sky. Did alright. Train wreck. Was not bad. <laughs> okay. Cantaloupe seems like my best one. I remember that one. With the, the giant factory of um, natural gas. I want to see this one though. This was system. Okay. Come on. Come on system. You can do it. G'day Tezuto. G'day Supernova. Welcome guys. Come on. Come on game. I believe in you. Oop. Don't. Suspense. Oh, what a tease. Okay, I think we'll have to start a new game. <laughs> I mean, I was going to start a new game, but I wanted to see what was going on in there. See, this is why I don't want to play with too many mods. In fact, I might, I might turn more of them off. Did they fix like the, the sync cues in the, in the, you know, vanilla game? Cause it always annoyed me. Why can't multiple dupes use one sync? <laughs> they need like a sync each. 
We'll see. Um, camera zoom out. I don't know. They might have changed it. Let's take a look at this. It hasn't been updated. Oh no, it was updated in 20th of March. Local updated. Oh, what? Why can't you update it then? Hmm. Let's get rid of that. Maybe that's messing with it. Oh, come on! <laughs> I... What is going on? You know what? I'm going to... I'm going to leave the beta. I'm in the beta, but I think the, the beta and the regular version are the same at the moment, so maybe that's messing with stuff. I don't know. Don't need decom props. It's a regular skill. Okay. I, did I, I think I disabled it, did I? No, I just want to get in the game. I should have done this beforehand. I knew something like this would happen. Once we actually get in, we should be fine. Ah, oh, come on. <laughs> Why? <laughs> Why didn't you do it like the five times it restarted already? Okay. All right, all the mods are installed. Good. So now, ah, look, all the messages are gone. So maybe it's just mod updater. Um. I don't know what they've added. I just, I want my blueprints. I need my blueprints. I should go through and get rid of the ones that I don't need. Bigger camera zoom. Look, I will leave it like this, and then... Oh, come on. <laughs> okay. So you have to restart every time you enable a mod. Come on. Why? Have we not restarted enough already? Um, so yeah, we'll just go in like this, and then if I find that there are some things in the vanilla that it still can't do, then I'll enable more mods later. Also, I wonder, have they added any new asteroids since the last time? So should we try this one more time? <laughs> I reckon we'll try it. We'll try it. All of our mods seem to be like they're behaving now. <laughs> Humor me, chat. I can hear the the music. Hey. Okay. 
Ah, uh, I remember this one. I remember this. Everything's very messy. <laughs> it's not, not great. Ah, uh, here is nice. This was my, my second asteroid. We were on Earthino. I think. It was the main one. Ah oh, yeah, we're building this transit tube. And digging out there for some reason. Yeah, all right. we had some stuff going on in here. We had a glass forge, got some solar panels. I remember the batteries kept breaking because of the difference between the vacuum and the... So we won't do that. <laughs> and then I built them down here and that worked a lot better. Okay. So I'll try to remember that. Um, I think this time I won't give dupes skills too early. Because then they, I found that they always got really, um, ooh, I don't remember this button. They got really over leveled and then they were all like upset. It's not, see, I, I got to a point where I stopped giving them skills because I'm just like, I don't want you guys to be upset anymore. And we finally, we got better foods and things, so they're okay, most of them. But it kind of forces me to, to rush getting good food very quickly, which can be a bit annoying. Also, is this the robot one? Yeah, I had a, had a bot here who shut down underwater. <laughs> um, and I don't think we got a second one. So, that's that. This is, uh, Currently unmanned. I don't know. I might come back to this on my own time and see if I can salvage it. See if we have more than zero calories. Ah, okay. Anywho, it's nice to see that still lives. This is a tiny game like Terraria. I... I guess it wouldn't be the best to watch on um, on mobile. It does have a lot of small details, yeah. Also, we have a supply closet now. We have skins. Um, I've claimed all the blueprints apparently. Whoa! Nice. So I can make some skins in the game? What the heck? <laughs> okay. What? Oh wow. What is this? Um, comfy bed. Oh, we won't be making that for a while, unfortunately. I can make this early though. Early days. Oh, that's so cool. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> Payphone. Uh, oh, that's cool. And then we got the clothes. The clothes, I don't really care too much about. There's also skins that you can get in-game. Yo! Nice! <laughs> okay. Awesome. Is it a strawberry? Yeah, it was. No, it's a watermelon. It's a candy watermelon. It does look like a strawberry, that one. Cool. Okay. Well, that's that. Apparently, like in, in DST, you can get um, seven daily skins and eight weekly skins. This game, there are no daily skins at the moment, but you can get three weekly skins. So we'll get those either today or tomorrow. Art is based off real pieces. Yes, I I noticed. Um, what is it? This looks like uh, one of them was like the, the Andy Warhol or something. 
This one, maybe? I, I, it's been so long since I did art history. Oh, this is the, the person painting the person doing... I forgot what that is. Ooh. <laughs> and that's it. Okay. Ooh. Makes it interesting. Okay, let's play the game. I have delayed long enough. Um, spaced out. Yeah. Ooh. Damn. Four traits. I don't know what that is. Power up a colossal relic from Gravitas's underground sleep lab. When duplicates sleep, their minds are blissfully blank and dream free. Under the right conditions, things can be different. Oh, is that the, the thing that gives them a, a new trait or something? Genetic manipulation device for critters? What? Mysterious hermit? <laughs> Pearl? <laughs> Asteroid has a few skeletons. Oh, damn. Oh, those are the only ones. Okay. Or is it for this world? Portraits. Portraits. Okay, they all have the same ones. What is that? Frozen foss, uh, forest asteroid. Lift asteroid. Radioactive ocean asteroid. Yikes. Um, the Desolands. lands. I thought that was the bad lands. They changed it. Okay. Metallic swampy. Um, Quag Miris. Okay. So cool. And then we got Folia. You keep changing the names. And Irradiated Forest. Why is this the first one? Irradiated Forest. Crash satellites. I think I'm probably gonna start with the default one because I just, I need to learn the game. <laughs> and then once I learn the game, I can go with something a bit more difficult. So I think either this one or Folia. Damn, this one has got a lot of things. It's got a radioactive crust. My mold. And a frozen core. Yo, I love a frozen core. But then that means it doesn't have oil. Oh no, it does have... Oh, that's nearby, okay. That is one thing that I kind of dislike. Or well, not dislike, but... Oh, this also has... The ocean? Frozen friend? Oh wait, I'm... I'm confused. Wait, so this isn't that. This is that. Okay, so this is Terrania Asteroid with no traits. <laughs> it has nothing special about it whatsoever. And then these are the ones that are nearby. I see. I see, I see. G'day, kites. How are you doing? Um... I 
I just want one that's got a, a lot of stuff. Just lots of different things. Metallic caves, metal rich, metallic caves, metal rich, frozen friend, uh, lush, frozen. I don't know what I want. I don't know. Just give me like a little bit of everything. Subsurface, lush, rich. Maybe you can't get everything. Geodes. Metal Rich makes life much easier. Okay. We'll go with this one. So we got oil, we got satellites, we got slime, a friend. Sounds good. And I mean, we'll make it work, you know, it's all good. It's all good. We'll leave everything default. We'll be fine. We'll be fine. Famous last words. G'day Zador, how you doing? Success, space adventure awaits. Okay, so we've got Turner, Ren, and Bert. <laughs> He's a rock fan. Wow, I've never seen rock fan. Uh, decreased calories. You mean increased calories? I always found that kind of confusing. Like, he eats more. So then, your colony has decreased calories. <laughs> I think. Yo, nice glove. Alright, so how this is going to work. Um, if you redeem that, you can get your, your name in the game. I will rename the first dupe in the list to your Twitch name. And then, that's it. You don't get another one. Unless your dupe dies, potentially. <laughs> um, so let's get, we will get a researcher, then we'll get a digger, and maybe a farmer, or a chef. What do you reckon, chat? Armor or chef? Or something else? What else is there? I could do builder, but like everyone can build. Everyone can dig as well. But I feel like it's good because eventually you'll need to dig through, through deeper stuff. Don't think I'll get a rancher, that's too early. I think I'll go with Farmer. Nisbet. <laughs> okay, Kitchen Manners. <laughs> uh, minus 15 cooking speed, that's fine. That's good too. Uh, all right, we'll stay with Abe. Abe is fine. Uh, increased bladder, that's fine. Increased construction is good. Uh, decor minus 15.
Oh, but like, we probably want someone with a little bit more digging. Like that. Requires light to... No, thanks. Uh, that's fine. Do I like advice? Um, if it's warranted, sure. I think I do... I want to learn, you know? I want to learn how to be better at this game, because I still... I kind of suck. Ooh, that's handy. Increased air consumption. Ooh. That's basically like another dupe. I'd rather not, actually. Damn. Minus 75%. Look, if you're going to be one of the first three people, you need to know how to build. Uh, we'll try to not get anyone with allergies if I can. That's fine. Okay. Digger, build, and researcher are solid. Uh... We'll go with a builder then, instead of farmer. Where's builder? Okay. Plant murderer. Sounds good to me. Alright, and this will be... Rhombus... Incorporated. I can't put a, can't put a dot there. You know. Yeah. Okay. It just doesn't accept those. Fair enough. And I'll rename them. So who did we get? We got Guav. I'm just going to type it exactly like your name is. Then we got Parade. And okay. Cool. Unlike Cult of the Lamb, I'll, I'll try to look after you guys. <laughs> we only have three workers. We kind of need... To Ooh, nice water at the start. Hell yeah. Okay. Detected a new cluster of material rich planetoids in nearby space. If I can guide the duplicants through the perils of space travel, we could build a colony even bigger and better than before. Okay. So let's have a little look around. Got some water there. Got some water there. Uh, polluted water. And that's about it. Oop. Uh, maybe some ice down there? Okay. So, I guess we'll make our way to this water and collect that. Hopefully, it doesn't go through here. What was the germ overlay again? F9. Hey! What the heck? Gonna give me slime lung already. All right, we'll go for this one then. Where's that even coming from? Hopefully it just dies in the oxygen. It's, ah, oh, it's polluted oxygen. Game, please. Already given me the hard ships. Um, all right, I think we need to dig a little bit so I can get enough stuff to build. Ooh, grid view, list view. Oh, wow. Oh, that's so cool. And they have a search bar. Wow, this game has changed a lot since I last played. I don't need to know how to dig, thank you. Alright, 
Let's just go down there. Is it, what is this? Fertilizer. Oh, jeez. Natural gas geyser. XE32 minus 1 times 1. What the heck? <laughs> what does that mean? Okay. Well, we got natural gas. That's nice. Uh, is that oil? Oh, not oil. Um, ethanol? Or is it water? I don't know. We can't quite see yet. You can rename it? Oh, really? Oh, you can too. What the? Why? <laughs> Why would I want to rename it? What would I even call it? Go to priorities. Yeah, I mean, it's it's early days. It's fine. We don't need to stop them from doing things just yet. Um, I'm just hoping that this slime lung will eventually go away. I think because this is... Uh, is I saw one polluted oxygen. Whatever. I'll come back to it later. So we need to make a pitcher pump, right? Maybe we'll get some beds. Do we want to sleep on the floor tonight? How do you choose a skin? Ah, nice. Um, let's just, I mean, I'll, I'll change this stuff later. We need an outhouse as well. Uh, I can go there. Beds on first night. I know. I know. It's a rare sight. There was DST crossover. There's, I mean, if you count skins, there's a tiny bit of crossover. Alright, they're already bored. Let's just dig all that out. This is going to make things very hot. I mean, it's good. I like having it there, but one, we won't be able to use it for a while. And yeah, two, it's going to, we need to get like the insulated tiles pretty damn quick. Nice. <laughs> Why does it do that? <laughs> oh, hello. Uh, let's kill that guy free food Wait. looks like it has who's Guta Zuta <laughs> it's because the name is behind <laughs> So what is the first thing that I should build? Maybe get some stations so I can build other things. Put it next to there so we get some light. Hello. Yeah. Building, digging. 
Okay. I don't think... We don't really have anything that we need to stop them from doing. Unless I just, like, no one else do that. You get hurt. Okay. Raid stock? Ah, oh, they are too. Of course. Well, already. Bed and bath. Let's go. Okay, let's get rid of all that. And uh, we need a little generator and a battery, I guess. Um, let's put that down here because there's not that much space. Oh, and then that's going to have to go in here. Noise. Germs and disease. Don't care. I think uh, disease is kind of fine, right? Slime lung is not going to kill anyone. It just makes them like kind of slow, yeah? No. Disease won't end you. That's nice. I remember back in the day where it's like if you if you even thought about slime long, you were just dead. <laughs> Good times. Uh let's not do that. How is there even disease in there? What? Ah, from the outhouse. I see. Um. Alright, I'm gonna have to get rid of this. Alright, hurry up then. G'day, JJ. I will add more names to the points redeem thing as we get them too. Uh, it should be... It will be out of stock at the moment, but we'll get more. Soon. Alright, let's build that there. Someone can get on the research and maybe we'll head up here and grab these things. I don't know if I want to go into here and just flood my base with carbon dioxide just yet. Not just yet. Maybe soon. We can also go down. Good day, Argonath. How's it going? Use the resources I want. Filter the ones I don't. Control the flow of gas. Damn. So much has changed. Okay. So. Um, what will we start with? Has this gotten bigger? Probably. They just can't help themselves. <laughs> making more of this stuff. I normally just start with the basic... Farming. It's always a good place to start. You play when there was rad bolts. Um, 
I I've played a tiny bit with the the DLC stuff. A tiny bit. So like enough to know what they are, but not enough to really know how to use them much. I researched a few things with like the the new research requirement, whatever it is. But we're a long way away from that. Okay, you're researching. We'll get these ones pretty damn quick. And we said we, we need to kind of go towards insulated tiles because of that really hot thing. Uh, where is that? It's probably better just to this one. All right. Oh, I'm going to need a supercomputer. <sighs> okay, we'll go for that first then. Ever seen the cot skins? Yeah, this is the only one I have. But it's cool. I like it. I guess there's no way to change it once it's been built. I have one for... Um, the plastic one too, but I, I can't build that yet. Okay, um, they're already bored. Shall we make a micro musher? <laughs> Just for fun, so you can make some food. I normally don't even bother making one, but We'll, we'll do it this time. All right, water cooler, crafting station, crafting station? What is crafting station? Produces items and equipment for duplicate use. What is this? I've never heard of this. <laughs> oxygen. Ah, oh, oxygen masks. Ah, oh, okay. Is that it? That's the only thing that can craft? I want to build it to see what it does. If it's no good, I'll get rid of it. I don't think we need oxygen masks, but... Still slime long, but it's it's decreasing. Like you see, there's 30,000 there. There's only 2,000 there. Also, this should be... This way? Wash when passing... Wait. Uh, when passing from left to right. Okay, yes, that's what I want. I always get confused. Alright. Let's dig out. Look at that. It's perfectly placed. Um, I'm guessing I haven't researched oxygen masks yet, so they can't make anything. Alright, mush bars... Mush bars... Are preferable to starvation, but only just barely. <laughs> okay, and what is that made out of? Dirt and water. Nice. <laughs> Grizzly quality. I mean... I mean, what is the nutrient bar is grizzly quality as well, so... I mean, it's not that much different, is it? We've got lice loaf, 
which is terrible quality. And tofu. Ah, we need nosh beans. That's standard quality. Wow. Go nosh beans. Well, we won't have them for a long time. But we might have meal lice. Is there a way that I can stop them from eating the meal lice raw? I think they're... Yeah. Don't eat that. Because I want you to eat actual food. Um, but who is the chef here? I don't think we have one. They have no skills. Nice. Um, who is going to be doing the cooking? You have minus three skill, Guav. So, not you. And everyone else is fine. G'day, Rainy. Haven't seen this in a while. Yeah. It's good to be back. We'll get another dupe soon, so that'll speed things along. Uh, do you have a ruler? Is there a ruler you just kind of dig and see how long it is? 14 tiles. How far across do you guys normally go? 14? 16? Also, I just noticed our place is Astorilios. Yikes. You go 16? I think I normally do 16 as well. 18 to 20? Damn. I'm just thinking like... Uh... A lot of the rooms are restricted by size, yeah? So this is 56 tiles. 16 is 64 tiles. I think it was 96 was the limit for, for the bathroom, wasn't it? Uh, no, 64 for a washroom. Okay. 64. So I guess... 16 is where it's at. 16 by 4, 64. Perfect. Thank you, Andre, for the follow. Close with doors. Ah, oh, yeah. So you go 18 and then the sides. Yeah, that makes sense. I get what you mean. So if we did like this and then... The first and the last tile will be doors and walls, so... Okay. I'm cool with that. More research. So, we did that. Now we'll go for the insulated tiles, I guess. Because we'll need them for this bad boy. <laughs> I mean, he's closed off in there. But... We're already really close to a bunch of things that are hot, so. The sooner we get this, the better. Ooh, to convey a thing over there. Some oxalite in there. Uranium. Nice. I don't think I've ever had like a, a natural gas geyser so close to me. That'll be handy. Ladder shaft leaves a space and then another tile before door starts. Wait, so you have one, two, three. I normally do three. I have ladder and then I'll do Hour on the ladder and then have like one for plumbing and one for something else. This is, uh, it's not going to look like this. It's just temporary. Uh, meal lights, that's fine. Because they can reach like one tile away from the ladder. Wait, and you leave a space on either side of that? Damn. How do they get across? You just leave it an empty tile? Or... 
I guess that would, that would be nice because then there'd be space for like tubes and stuff later on. Because like if I if I had this, then a space. And you said another space, they can only jump one, right? So I would need another ladder or just a tile that I might destroy later. Hmm. Alright, I'm thinking. Alright, we'll get rid of that. And... I'll have to move... This. Maybe. I mean, does it even matter if it's on the floor? <laughs> it's got food poisoning. Come on. Come on, guys. Alright. Let's, uh, let's destroy Guav's bed. We'll make another one. Ooh. Study 10 terrestrial artifacts. Study 10 space artifacts. What is an artifact? Alright. Uh, machinery. Increased bladder doesn't matter too much, I don't think. I don't want someone who farts. That's just really annoying. So maybe I'll take this person. Bubbles. <laughs> I don't really care about the hatchling. Alright. Um, let me change the... The reward. So I'll add one extra. Okay. Cool. So you'll need a new bed then. Let's see. So get rid of that. So that's three. And then... You know what? Let's just get rid of them all. <laughs> Then I'll have space there, then a door there, and then they get built here. I think it is a good idea to plan with extra space in mind because I do have that issue too with like spaghetti piping and spaghetti wiring and stuff. It's like, damn, I wish I had planned with the future in mind, you know? And then I guess bathroom can be up here. We'll go for bathroom next. Do I have, I don't have, oh, they're still researching that, fine. Hmm? Oh, yes. Super computer. Art discriminator? <laughs> like, if it was just a visual thing, I wouldn't mind. But, like, they actually make natural gas. And it builds up, alright? It adds up. <laughs> I don't want to have to deal with that. Not in the base, anyway.
So and, uh, so that tile is going to be empty, and then this can be 16 across, like that. And then there'll be another tile like that. Do you guys, do you normally put like door and then door on top? Because I normally do just a door and then a wall. I don't know. Does it matter? I'll put it the next one. Double door. What is the benefit? More ventilation. Yeah. I guess. <laughs> it just, it looks silly. <laughs> oh, we can also, we can go straight to airflow tiles. Cool. What's the middle here? This is 15. Eh. 15. I said I wanted 16. So then, cool, cool. <laughs> That's 16, I think. 16. Door and then mesh tile above door. But mesh tile, doesn't that give you like minus decor? Does this give minus decor? This gives plus 10. I can't see mesh tile, but Maybe I'm not remembering. Oh, you can't even. Uh... G'day, Chill Hopper. How you doing? I normally just do a um, one or two airflow in the middle is how I go so if we're doing 16 that means that two tiles be 8 and 9 will be airflow like that Fill that in. So that would make a nice bathroom. Um, we just need to research the stuff. Plumbing. Yeah, all that stuff. Oh, we got a little egg. Is that an egg? I don't know. I can't click on it. Hey, we got mush bar. Nice. We got meat, muck root. Cool. Yeah, keep making them mush bars. Keep them coming. Right, where is Bob should be researching? Ah, oh, because it's not built yet, I see. Ah, advanced research. How close are we to getting a new skill? Bubbles comes with a skill. Um. You're good at machinery. I, I can't remember what you need that for. Um, I'm just going to leave you like that for the moment. 
and you're close okay probably like another cycle and then you'll level up how come you have no morale need <laughs> making conveyors is it also for the um the natural gas generator stuff i seem to remember needing one of them okay that i I knew as soon as I released the shine bug out of there, it was just going to make a beeline for the bedroom. <laughs> they always do. Nice. Alright. Um, yeah, we kind of just need that. Let's keep digging stuff out, I, I guess. Uh, it's a mob. What is it called? A harbinger of disease. And that's chlorine. Okay. Well, woo. Oh, hold on. Let's not dig into the sand. That might not be great. This is just the standard one, yes. Toilets? What do you mean? Urgently need to use a toilet. Use it then. Two visits remaining. Why is that in, in quotation marks? Visits. <laughs> Room will be intensely germy. Yeah, figures. I I've opened a room like that before. But this would be nice. Oh, I I don't even have the resources to use it, so whatever. We'll leave it for now. Well, seeing as we can't research that, let's go for this. Let's actually get some research done. Oh yeah, I need to fix you up. Um, so you don't do that. Let's have... Oop, bye. Let's have new people not doing that unless I tell them to. Everyone sucks at cooking. Okay. Seems good to me. Uh, this does not seem good to me. Go down there. Hey. What the heck? Oof. Okay. Um, we should probably get some oxygen in then. Um, I don't want to put it next to the beds because it gets pretty hot. Maybe I'll put it here so then it can go straight up there. G'day Chris, how you doing? Um, we also need algae. Let's see, do I have... Algae. 11 tons! Nice! All mechanics really daunting to learn. Yep. That sounds like Oni. 
I'm, I'm fairly good at the start of the game. It's once I get to like the oil and beyond, that's when it becomes just like too much. I normally can kind of stumble my way through there for a while. And I, I love oil, but my I get to a point where my dupes have too much to do and the, um, what do they call it? The travel time is, is just far too much. So by the time they get to wherever they need to go, they can't do anything. <laughs> and my colony just dies a very slow death of inaction. But it's fun. We'll try to get further this time. Guav earned a skill point! Yeah, Guav! Nice. You get a hat for that. <laughs> Yay! Okay, now you can do the, the research. Video duplicate morale. See, the bigger brain you have, the less happy you are. watch these videos more often they're cool <laughs> I've just been skipping them this whole time okay uh, we have idle people no research that's probably why where was the thing that I needed to research this one to get that skill points available Wait, I thought we did that our bubbles right bubbles Okay, you can stay like that. I guess I should probably get bigger batteries too, so that they don't run out so quickly. And if we have... we did the plumbing stuff, cool. So now I can set up a, a nice little bathroom. Um, do you guys use showers? Are showers necessary? Uh, we'll just have four for the moment. Shower every day before work. Oh, <laughs> you smart ass. And a sink. Okay. Hopefully the sink queue thing still works. Then we need one of these. Ah, uh, I see. I see what I've what mistake I've made. <laughs> uh, okay. Do that. And we'll replace the pitcher pump. Build a liquid pump. Mm. There. Okay. 
Yeah, I think a shower is it's not an urgent priority, but I like building them. It's like an easy source of morale. Why not? that but then I can just go straight up go up there Infinite water set up with showers and toilets. Um. Well, I mean, when they shower, they they don't consume any water. It just you have you have clean water and it comes out as dirty water. Speaking of which, we're gonna need a place to dump the dirty water. So I guess that can go down into a, a little well somewhere. Um, so how many tiles? It's gonna end up being like 20. <laughs> There's no germs in there. And use infinite dirty water, turn into water and back into toilets. Yeah. If I have a water sieve. I will do that eventually. I don't think I... How far away is researching that? I could go towards it. I got sand. What am I getting at the moment? Maybe after I get this. Because then that would be nice. Although, does this require... It doesn't require operation, but it does require someone to put sand in it every now and then. Which can be annoying. But that would save me having to make a whole polluted water thing, so it's probably worth it. Um, Alright, let's put that... Put that up here. Or, I'll, I'll figure that out later. That's fine. Can't have that. Ah, slime lung is basically gone from there. Oxygen is okay. Good. Food. Pretty good. Eat. Mm. Like, we got dust caps there. And we got a thimble reed, which is really nice. So we can pretty quickly grow some good crops. Hey, parade made a mess. <laughs> oh, at least you did it down there. Tutorial, but no video. Oh, whoa. Whoa, 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 whoa. Not that one. <laughs> Not yet. <laughs> Hold on. That was a close one. <laughs> Uh, 
Okay. Oh, where? Okay. Thank God. <sighs> That's really annoying. Like the last person to use it for the night. Backed it up. And so no one was going to fix it until the morning. But when the morning comes, they need to use it. So they just made a mess. Yeah. Oh. Yo, damn. Hey, bubblegum gloves. Nice. <laughs> oh, so cool. So that's what that is. Okay. <laughs> Hopefully that doesn't collapse into here, but I guess if it does, it's not the worst thing that could happen. We're producing a lot of food. We probably don't need that much food. I'd rather you guys do other things. Alright, what do we got? Tablets, brine, builder we already have. We don't really need someone, a pilot right now. He's got a green thumb. Agriculture is not bad. Um, and he's stylish, but he can't dig. <laughs> Trofell though. Look at that, plus 15 construction. Holy shit. Should we get Trofell though? Or should I try to stick with less dupes until later? Hmm. Travaldo's monotonous voice and lack of facial expression makes it impossible for others to tell when he's messing with them. Take Nicola? The narcoleptic though? I don't know. Not a fan. And I have a builder, so it doesn't seem that useful. Nicola isn't that bad. Like, I don't mind the irritable bowel, and kitchen menace is fine. Hmm. Okay. Alrighty. Plus 15. It's too good to pass up, I guess. Alright, now they're just building. Um, so I could probably tap into this, seeing as we've got this going now. Maybe I'll let it run a little bit first. This produces 500 grams per second, so it's good for five dupes, which we have. So, if I want any more dupes, I need more oxygen. 15 construction and handy, plus three. Oh, did he? I didn't notice that. Yeah, 18 construction. Damn, plus 450%. <laughs> I don't think I've ever seen a starting dupe with with that much. Got bristleberry. Hey. Nice. Um after I get this set up, I would like to do a farm, I think is the next one. But I'll I'll let them do one thing at a time. Don't want to push them too far.
Also, yeah, maybe I will add a new schedule. So this is default one. This is uh schedule two. I don't know. Oh, well, this will be alternate schedule as a capital. Okay. So with this one, you just have your have your downtime like. At the start of the day. Like that. Be fine. It won't matter too much once we have this set up. I guess. So, insulated tile, nice. Okay, now that that is done, we'll go for the water sieve. Ooh, another video, let's go. <laughs> With Stinky. Is it Stinky or Harold? I don't know. Nice job. <laughs> oh, okay, cool. Yeah, I think we we understand how the ins and outs work. Oh, now we can make berry sludge. Ooh. Ah, oh, sleep wheat. Yeah, like we're ever gonna get that. Ah. Uh, but that's like good quality. Damn. I like it. Working creativity. I know. I mean, it's just any clay game at this point. It's insane the amount of little, little details and... Yeah, you can you can tell that they they really love their game, their work. Cool. Stay wheat farming is a fun challenge. I hate it. <laughs> it's so annoying. We should go this way. Just the act of farming it heats the plants up so that they won't grow anymore. Alright, so we want to not have these working yet because there's nowhere for the water to go. But soon, we're getting there. Thank you. Like building cooling loops. 
That's another thing I suck at. Like, steam turbines are hard. Um, cooling, I, I struggle with. Even like uh, building Rodriguez and stuff. I think I have it saved. Because otherwise I just, I forget. No, <laughs> come on. Why? Never mind. Um, I think the day just started, so... Do you guys use those mods too? I thought that the, the blueprint mod would have been a, a fairly common one. I'm surprised that it doesn't work. Awesome mod update. But they were all up to date though. Because I, I just, I pressed right, which should go to like the next blueprint. It crashed. So. I'll, we'll look at the mods and see when it was updated. Couldn't play this game without blueprint. I know, it's it's like the essential mod. Yeah, like it seems fine. What's wrong? What's wrong with you then? No, it should work, right? Wait, cycle eight? Was I cycle eight? Oh, I guess I was. Okay. I feel like, no, I should be much more than that. <laughs> Been issued with that particular blueprint? Oh. What do you suggest that I do then? I mean, thankfully, I don't need to build anything from it right now. Okay. Oh, we got skill points. Um, you are a builder. Okay. I guess we can go for the ones where they have the hearts because then they don't lose any morale. You're the digger. You're also a builder. And, eh, why not? Give them all hats. Alright, so we'll, we'll try again, I guess. <laughs> so that blueprint works. I'll press right, crash. Ooh, not good. Blueprints should be 2.4.9.6? Hmm. How do I update? Should I um, unsubscribe and resubscribe then? Let's see. There's a way to force it in the menu. Okay. Hmm. 
I feel like mods work a lot better in DST compared to Oxygen Not Included for whatever reason. There's none of this constant stopping and restarting and I feel like they crash a hell of a lot more. Okay, so... How do I get it to update itself? Currently install version compared with the mod release note. Yeah, so what? Because <laughs> there used to be, there was like a little error button that you could click on and it would update. But that's only if it is out of date and the game doesn't think it's out of date. <laughs> so... I might just unsubscribe and resubscribe. I think that's the easiest way. Because then it will definitely install... into the game. Nice. <laughs> Classic. We had a lot of, I had to go back into the game about five or six times when we started the stream. It's just like that. 11 out of date. Nice. I think I had 6. Okay. Did you do it? 2.4. It's still... It was the same. <laughs> Come on. We'll get there. We'll get there eventually. Okay. I don't know if it's going to work, but we'll try. Maybe I'll try go the other way mod. So instead of going right, I'll go left. If it's that particular blueprint that might be causing it to crash. Let's also we'll see if I can make it. I can make a new blueprint that works. Oh, no, no. Ah. <laughs> so it's just anyone. <sighs> Mod updater. Okay, I'll try that. Because I, I have that mod, but I had to disable it because it was out of date and it was making the game crash. Okay. 
Where is it? Mod updater. Enabled. Okay, we'll restart again. <laughs> Come on. A lot of only mods say to update from GitHub. Oh, really? So it's, it's Steam's fault? Hopefully this mod will just do it for us. It's strange how that happens though, because like I see, I have a lot of mods for DST, like hundreds. And every time I open Steam, I see there's always like at least a couple of workshop updates viewed in the, in the Steam downloads. I don't know why you can't do the same for Oxygen Not Included. Yeah, this is what I mean. Okay. Update 6 mods which appear to be out of date. And then when I click that, it crashed. Yeah. <laughs> so... Um... What's that about? Click options. Okay. Then enable auto update. So, are you saying the auto update works when the manual update does not? Because I would have thought that the auto update would just do what the manual update did. G'day, April. Okay, okay. Options. Uh, where's auto update? Passive mode? Automatically keeps on what? Ah, oh, okay. Okay. <laughs> Need to idle only for my skins? Have you actually been doing that? I got a skin today for the first time ever because like I've never I haven't played the game since they introduced them nice got some bubble gum gloves something it's fast really well I've only got one drop and I've been playing for an hour and a half so Ooh, it updated? It still says 2.4.1 So... Nah, no, come on. I didn't do anything. <laughs> so, I don't know, is it working or not? mod on my mod updater. Ah, whatever. I'm just gonna play. <laughs> Hopefully it just fixes itself. I have an actual auto update. Oh my god. Maybe we have different versions of the mod? Are there multiple mods? I don't know. Not disabled. Okay, whatever. I'm just not gonna use it for the moment. Um... There we go. G'day. How you doing? They have to take time out of their day to go and receive their hats. No, everyone has a hat. 
Should we put food in here? We're storing three kilos in there out of our 41,000 kilocals. What's the what's the next one up from kilocals? Mega cals? Is it, I always found it kind of strange to be like 40 41 thousand thousand. Like why not just use the next one? Just put edible in there. Actually, I don't know. Does it even matter? Then they're just going to be moving things around for ages. So we're working on the sieve, wherever it is, there it is, All right, we're close. Feel the cal is just a calorie, but the formal measure, how can it be one calorie, but also a thousand, that makes no sense. Ah, oh, this needs power too, of course. Of course. Okay. And once I get the sieves, I will get bigger batteries. So then they don't have to run on the treadmill all day. Do I treat them better than my cult? I do, yes. <laughs> Unfortunately, if I don't look after these dupes, we're not going to get much done. Nice. Looking for any more, ah, uh, the supply one. All right. Very good. Ah, all right. Um, who we got next? Bubbles. Ah, change outfit. Ooh. Oh, that's cool. I'll come back to that. So this one will be... Breeze. Nice. Want to name another one Glow? No. One per person. <laughs> oh shit, I need another bed. Glow instead of April? No. It's not allowed. Jumbo. Ooh, should I go for smart batteries? Maybe we will. I'm not allowed to sign up other people for this business. Okay, so the water sieve produces clean water from polluted water using sand. Very nice. Oops. Um, so if dirty water is going to come out there, I can just like chuck it in there. And then it goes back in. Let's just do it that way. Is it going to get backed up though? I feel like I should make... I guess when I research it, I'll make a... A little tank. Ooh! Hello? Watermelon Glovelet. Nice. Risk coverage is so overrated. 
Okay. Build an overflow for extra polluted water. Yes. Okay. Yeah, I, I was just saying it wasn't me. Yeah, Michael. How you doing? So this will go. Maybe I'll wait until I get that, and then that will come back out. Go into there. And does that need power? Of course it does. Why wouldn't it need power? 120? Oh my gosh. We're gonna have to get some power set up then, because uh, we're gonna need it. Ooh, lice loaf, cool. And let's look at, we need coal, keep an eye on that. And uh, what is it, copper that we'll get here? Not a whole lot of copper. We haven't really dug into these areas though, so it should be fine. Blasting music at 3 a.m. Do you live alone? Do you not have like roommates and shit? If I did that, I would be murdered, most likely. I would cease to exist. Live alone? Ah, oh, that must be so nice. <laughs> Alright, so what was the thing? I need a water No. Um it was like the the tank, yeah? Storage? Storage? Smart storage. Um liquid. Liquid. Filter. Liquid Reservoir, that's the one. Oh, nice. We'll go for that. And then the smart battery. <laughs> oh, you get the whole house. Nice. I mean, obviously not an ideal situation, but it's a pretty sweet deal. Water based. So this probably should be a, a slightly higher priority as well, because we kind of need that to be running. So we'll get that going when we can. Ah, we do get an ethanol distiller, but we have no lumber, so... We also have no slime. Toilets. Zero out of five. Zero for five. Okay, it's fine. We're all good. Never mind. Who is it? April, come on. <laughs> How could you? The toilet was there and ready to use and everything. How far we need to go? 18. I guess it's just, it's 20, isn't it? Yeah, it's 20 across. So we'll do that. Yep. 
Ooh, we're almost out of slime long. There's a tiny, tiny bit in there. It's fine. It'll go away eventually. There's still something in here though. Oh, but even that is dying. Hell yeah. Um, I don't know if I want another dupe. Sand. Hey, we might need that eventually. Starts with tier two. Oh, plumbing. Oh yeah. Yeah, I think I'm going to take the sand. <laughs> and research. What did we... Wait, what did we research? Plumbing. No. Yeah, plumbing. Oh yeah, for those things. Cool. Okay, I'll set that up in a sec. Now let's go back to the battery. My battery. Yeah. Nice. So, liquid reservoir. Um, the water goes in. I can't rotate it? Oh, that's annoying. Why? Why? This needs to go on the other side then. Why do they do that? Okay, so it goes in here, but from the from the dirty. Yeah? My brain. More things can be rotated. Yeah, I know. I thought it could be. It would have been nice. Oh, well. Okay. So. That has to go in on that side. And out of that comes clean water. Oops. I keep pressing R for rotate, but it's actually O for otate, of course. Um, the clean water comes out this way. But it has to come out. Who designed this? <laughs> come on. Um, white and green out. Yeah, I get it, but it's just they don't match on the side that I want them to be, and I can't rotate this one. So, like, I'll just place it down. So, if I put that there, the white already has to come out, has to go in there. So that goes there, and then it blocks this off, which is annoying. So then I can do... I can put this on that side. But then the clean water comes out here. But I want the clean water to go in there. Like, why? Why can't I have it where I don't need to have a bridge? It's so annoying. Or I, I just, I go around this way, I guess. <sighs> it's just silly. It's all this guy's fault. Whatever, I guess that's like the best I can have it. We're making spaghetti already. I mean, it's not like I'm not used to bridges. It would just be... It's annoying to have to need it when there's only two things here. Like, you shouldn't have to. You could just rotate it.
Why the liquid bridge? <laughs> All right, fine. I'll put a bridge. Um, so it goes in. This one has to go. Just put it like that. But like, I want it to go in here. So what? I need a bridge there and a bridge here. Whatever. It's fine. It's fine how it is. It's gonna look ugly either way. Hey! Why? Why make a mess? I don't understand. There was a perfectly good bathroom. Why? They just stand in it, like they're proud. <laughs> oh my god. Can- is it not- oh, it's out of order? What? That bugged? That's so weird. Can they... they can reach it. Hmm. That makes an errand. Confused. Like, I know I disabled this because they... I want them to use that instead. Hmm. Go down left hand side. Um, I could, I guess. It would still need to go above there. Ah, it's fine, whatever. I think I'm complaining more than I need to. It's fine. It's not a big deal. I mean, by the time they build that, this will be built and then they won't need that anymore. But, uh, jumbo battery! Let's go, finally. Ow. Cool. Um, I'll just chuck one there. Alright, so can they use it now? Yes. Interesting. There, JC. Uh, is it good? It seems difficult. It is difficult, but it is good. That helps. <laughs> Alright, uh, this needs to be high priority. Good, it's ready to go. Oh, it needs a thousand kilos. It needs a ton of filtration medium. Interesting. 
Um, but at least now you can use these things. Uh, let's block that one and that one because I want them to pass the sink. G'day, Kazo. Have you been pl playing much only recently? Farm Lily, uh, it's a hot area. He only plays Dota? Ah, uh, I see. <laughs> Every day I'm, I'm eternally grateful that I didn't get into Dota. I say a prayer every evening. <laughs> Dota and League. Thank you. I made a wise choice there. <laughs> um, I wonder if I... I don't, I don't need to like make walls around this. It's fine, I think. For the moment, anyway. I want to see them use these. I want to see that they work. Research. Um, so maybe now... Oh, I didn't even finish that. I was going to say now we'll go for like better farms, but we'll get farms full stop would be nice. Look at April going. Nice. <laughs> Every day I'm shocked. Dude, I have not heard that song in a, in a hot minute. <laughs> um, I wonder, is there a way, can they like fill this manually? Because like I've got all of this um, polluted water just sitting around. I don't really know what to do with it. I would have to build like a little reservoir for it, which is annoying. Oh well, gotta do what you gotta do. Bottle things? Bottle things? What are bottle things? Like, I want to put it in a container. It's in plumbing. Like, there's the bottle emptier. But... I, that will only put it in an open place. Ideally, it would be nice if I could put it into the reservoir to dump it into a bottle empty. Oh, okay. I see. Well, it's better than nothing, I guess. I could make like a tiny little place here. Dump it all in there, and then put it straight in there. Or I could just make uh, a new area. Also, if this is working, that means that I don't need this anymore. Don't need, like, now that it's already started. Um, and I just disconnect there. Nice. Cool. I'm so glad they added that. One, two, three, four, five. 
I'll just build like a little room in there for now. Get that out. Get a ladder. What was that? Research. Ah. Egg cracker. Nice. The farm tiles is the important one. And let's put some mesh tiles. Nice, keep it even. And then I'll put the emptier. Empty it on anyone walking down the ladder. <laughs> Yeah, we're going to need some power. Can I rotate that? No. Okay. What is on this circuit? 960. Yikes. Already it begins. Okay, do that for now. In fact, what I can do, I'll just, I'll make a new one over here doesn't need to be connected to that at all. And then that goes... Yup. In there. Steel Soul. Finish game within 20 hours. I saw the achievements he got. That's insane, dude. I don't think I'll ever get those ones. Can I update these? You should be building. That's for sure. April has a new skill. Hey. I'm just going to leave it. <laughs> Wait, what? Suffocating. Hey. Why? Um... That is an issue. I'm guessing you can't go there. Why? Mm. Unreachable dig? I oh, can you not dig? Why can't you dig that? Of course you go there. <laughs> um, build a little ladder so you can stand above. There you go. <laughs> we figured it out. Good night. <laughs> Saw back. Oh no. <laughs> Yikes. Um, maybe we'll make a ladder on the other side. Oh, all good. The water tanks don't need power. Put it on the right and add a vent underwater. I think it's fine.
You guys, you have to explain things like I'm five years old. I think what I, the setup I have is fine. It works well enough. Okay. This is also working. Very good. So that should be all looped, ready to go. Should have no more toilet issues. Uh, get rid of them. Don't need them anymore. Pump will take power, water tank doesn't. Yeah, but how does it fill up then? You need some, you need to put water in there. As an input. Yeah. But, um, like, I want to put these bottles in there. So, the only way to do that is to empty them here and then put them in there, right? You're an achievement. Nice. Place all outhouses. Ah, oh, okay, yeah, all good. Do we need more oxygen in here? This bad boy's running overtime. It seems okay. I think it's because we displaced all of this carbon dioxide, so it's just going down. Maybe we should create some more space down here for it to fill into. And next... Um... I don't think I'll go for ranching just yet, but soon, maybe. Maybe fossil fuels don't have any. Artificial friends, Sweepy. Damn, as if you can research Sweepy so early and like the, just the space program stuff. Who does space this quickly? Don't even have electrolyzers and stuff. Maybe I'll get that next. I do have a Discord, yes. Exclamation mark Discord. As far as the toilet thing goes, this works. And like, as long as it works, I'm happy for the moment. <laughs> okay. And this will be polluted water. So they fill that up. It has no output, but that's fine. It does not need one. Hello? Ah, uh, meth leaf. Another pilot? Yikes. Ah, oh, I hate the light to sleep one. That's so annoying. Means I need to make them their own bedroom. Get out of here. <laughs> um, eh, I don't think anything else is worth it. Let's just get that. Also, we have five, so I don't really want to get any more right now. Maybe this one? Right, so that goes on there. What is that tile? It's just gonna off gas all the time now. I guess if I eventually sweep all of this away then I can just sweep whatever's left in there. But that's annoying. Oh well. The 
hello. And is this safe now? Still have a bit of slime long in there. Bugger. I, I'm not used to having slime lung so close to the start. Like, it's really close. We're doing DST with viewers. I normally have a, a community server going. Um, I haven't played, played it for a while. We need to start a new one. Well, I've earned a skill point. Nice. Um, get you some extra science. Oh, then you can do the geographic analysis. Nice. So you can go and study that thing. We do need that. Yeah, I've been meaning, or I've been thinking about starting a new dedicated server, but it hasn't happened for a bit. I don't want to start it until I feel like, oh, want to play it, you know? I wonder if I might need another one of these for the clean water. I don't know. Seems like we're getting more clean water than, than the polluted water. As long as it doesn't like block it from being used, that's fine. Being past the world edge? I don't think so. I've definitely I've been to the edges. I don't how do you see past the edge though? Alright, um Food. Let's get some crops going, I think. Um, we just go straight for hydroponic. I guess it depends on what seeds we have. Um, well, it's going to be mealwood, I guess. We have blossoms. We make bristle berries, which are nice. We've got 11 of them. We could. They need light though, and then it gets a bit warm. But we could. And they need water too, don't they? Ah, yeah, no, they, they suck up all of my water. <laughs> I remember that. Hmm. Yeah, so uh, it needs light. Temperature is fine. Water, that's the one. It's too much. I don't have any uh, geysers for water yet. If I find one, I'd consider it. Like a, a cool slush or something. Ooh, cool steam vent. Well, okay then. <laughs> I mean, steam is not quite water, but it's the next best thing. Uh, GQ42 minus 4 times 1. Right, remember that, chat. That'll be important. <laughs> That'll be on the test later. Yeah, it's a bit hot to really use. But it's better than nothing. Don't suppose we have any others down here? Bleached stone, no. Okay. No, I can't see any others. So, I guess we'll just go with mealwood then. Long story short. Which means that I can use this. And I'll put a... Do you guys use the farm stations? Micronutrient fertilizer? Eh, I don't know. 
Probably not necessary. What do we get? Ah. Good. Carbon skimmer. We may need to use that at some point. Oh, there's a little baby shine bug. He's happy and a tiny baby. <laughs> nice. I like them. Sense for voice as opposed to brass and woodwind DST. Is it synth? I don't even know what it is. So in here we'll be making some meal wood. So this just needs dirt. And that's about it. Then we get the meal lice. It's not the greatest. But it will keep him happy and well fed. Whoop. All right, now who is going to be the farmer? Do we have someone who likes farming? April has farming three, and so does Parade. But that's it. So <laughs> we don't really have a farmer. Um, I will give you guys a slightly higher. I mean, Abel can probably do it because they're not doing much of anything else. They have operating, but there's like nothing to operate, so. Uh, Parade is doing all the digging. So you can, you can do that a little bit more. Okay. It really doesn't matter too much. I'll probably hire a, a dedicated farmer at some point in the future, so. No need to stress. Some art. Well, we can't even make the art though because we don't have thimble reeds. But we can make the sculptures. And then maybe we'll get some automation for when I get some coal power. I think we're going to have to start with the dirty coal. Don't get the cute coal farmer hat. No, I mean, I could give you a farmer hat if you really wanted, but... Uh, you have to die. But I'm not sure if I want you to be the farmer. Oop. Yeah, like I could give you improved farming and then give you a farming hat, but I mean, yeah, why not? Why not? You're gonna do that job, you might as well get a nice hat. <laughs> hmm. I guess uh, there's no reason why this shouldn't be a barracks too, right? stuck in there, thank you. One thing this game does well that uh, DST could do is having music playing all the time. I think there's even a setting where you can change it. 
uh, yeah, play background music each morning. There's too many moments in DST where it's just like silence. Radiation lamp. When did I get that? It's radiation when powered that can be collected by a rad bolt. Nice. Do I have a rad bolt generator? Is it a station? I know what it is. <laughs> rad bolt. Researched it yet. Okay. DST music is for the big moments. I mean, boss music, yeah, but it'd be nice if there was just like music going on when you're not doing a whole lot. Because, like, it kicks in when you're harvesting stuff, but yeah. There's a lot of downtime, especially the further you get into the game. Having no music adds to the bleakness and loneliness. I mean, I guess. Oh, I built this on the wrong tile. Red has to heal up. Okay. So we normally find like the the teleporter pretty quickly. I'm surprised we haven't, unless that's it in there. Oh we no. I don't know what that is, but yeah, I'm surprised we haven't found that. What happened? Uh, you attacked the, what's we call it? This guy and he, he bit back. <laughs> it was only a, like a scratch. It's fine. You're not really hurt. And I'll probably get you to attack this one too. Get some nice food. Combat. <laughs> chlorine. Do we want chlorine in the base? Not really. What I could do, um, if I'm really clever, I go in here through the top, and when I open this, all the disease that comes out goes straight into the chlorine. Hell yeah. But then I have to do like a all the way around there. Aha! See, that is what I want. This is what I want. Full cool slush geyser. UO 24 minus 9 times 1. Hell yeah. Because this, this one is cold. Honestly, that is going to keep my base at a nice temperature until the end of the game. <laughs> okay. So we're heading up. Um, I think... I mean, I can go straight through here because it's just chlorine. It'll, it'll go and sit down the bottom anyway. We'll go a little bit further down. Nice. Chlorine makes me think of swimming pools. That's fair. Yeah. I mean, you'd normally associate chlorine smells with swimming pools. I haven't been to a swimming pool in so damn long. It's really good because this won't, I don't think it will be active until you clear those tiles because it's like kind of blocked. 
so we can decide when to open it like when we're ready and we got some nice water here and some nice water there Ooh, i gotta make this a bit bigger i think like a nice juicy tank now so that's one and i'll, I'll build a ladder this time <laughs> okay so one two three four then a tile and then one, two, three, four, and another tile. Okay. New printables. Search my incoming message history and find a single entry. I move the odd message into my database. Attention all Gravitas personnel. Evacuation protocol in effect. Reactor meltdown in bioengineering imminent. Remain calm and proceed to emergency accents. Do not attempt to use elevators. Okay. Algae. Ooh, or an artist. Oh, but he farts. Never mind. <laughs> Easy choice. Or he doesn't kill germs that quick. What I'll... I mean, because like, the germs won't have anywhere to go but in the chlorine, so as long as I don't open it here, we should be fine, I think. I'll have to go like all the way around. Alternatively, I just make a liquid lock, which I probably should do anyway. Look the building outside the initial starting biome. I did? Well, the ladder. I mean, it's hardly a building, but okay. Thank you, game. And I need these things. What is this? Cycle sensor. Yeah, okay, we could get. This is like, I'm fairly comfortable with this level of automation. Then beyond that is like, what the fuck is all of these things? I don't understand. <laughs> so, I think I will I will stick within my wheelhouse for the time being. You get a dupe who emits rads. I didn't I didn't even know that's a thing. It's pretty amazing. Ooh, it is it has food poisoning. No. You win some, you lose some. Bad luck. Um, maybe I make... Maybe I make my, uh... Liquid lock here. I just, I want it to be in line with the ladder. <laughs> Oh, it's polluted water. Okay. I mean, it just adds one extra step to using the water. But it's still worthwhile. And it, it has no pollution as well. Like, no slime lung or anything. Yo, nice music. Oh, uh, wait, hold on, what am I doing? Already have the bottom. Like that, yeah? We rotate it.
Oh. <laughs> uh, one, two, three, four. Son of a bitch. I mean, it locked it. <laughs> Alright. Um, build the rest of it. Yeah, see, this is making more water than it can. Well, than polluted water. It's very strange. Is there a way, I want to like, keep it so that this will hold all of the water until it's full? Do I need to put automation in there? Oh, they did it anyway. Okay, nice. We got a little bit of chlorine, but it's fine. Pick Discord. Okay. Let's see. Oh boy. What am I looking at here? <laughs> so you just have... You have both things going into this first. Overflows are looping without power. Yeah, but like don't... You need power for the water sieve. But other than that, you don't need power. some water in there. Oh, for the pump. Okay. I think it's okay. They put reservoir to output water. I think so, yeah. Might need another one of these. Um, hmm. So far, so good. I'll do it eventually, I think. Or not. Ah, uh, because we don't have actual water. Can they... I need to enable the auto bottle. They do it from the picture. Okay. Good night, parade. Have a good sleep.
I just wonder like if I I can send dupes through here and they'll be like I can be um, sure that the air won't get back through but the dupe will have to go back through so if they become you know diseased they'll just bring the disease in anyway so I I don't want to have to build oxygen things for that because that would be really annoying okay so I think this is going to be my main water area water tank gonna have to get rid of that shit Uh, might have to be relatively small for the time being. Put a sink, they have to pass through. Does the sink, like, stop them? Does it clean all of their germs away? Um, removes germs. Oh, I guess it does. What about this? Germ spread can be reduced, but is that completely removed? <laughs> I'll just build that. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, okay, it's fine. As long as it doesn't off gas, it's all good. Washing hands works 100% germs. Nice. Yeah, I know. It seems too good to be true, but hey, I'll take it. I think I will go towards... Exosuits though. Is this exosuit? Yeah. I like a good exosuit. Ah, so we got automation. Okay. So that will be for coal, I guess. How much coal do we have? Oh, we got a data bank. We have 17 tons of coal. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. Um. Is there a way if if I clean the water from here? Um, or if I purify, not purify. If I sieve the water from here. It's still going to have germs, right? Is there a way to clean the germs? Is there like a machine that does that? Or do I need to like heat it or... Do you recommend this game? Absolutely I would. It's great. You might need a little bit of patience to, to learn how to play it. But yeah, I recommend it. Um, just trying to think, where would I build the coal? Is there a place that's a little bit cool? Not really. I mean, I could put it up there. That's kind of far. Maybe I will eventually. Put it in chlorine atmosphere. Oh yeah, I could. This just seems like a really useful place. I want to head in there when I can. Put germ water in a room full of chlorine. Okay. Maybe after I get into here, I could use this chlorine then. Pump it out somehow. Oh, we got iron ore too. Nice. Because I'm trying to think, I will need 
it'd be nice to have a little reservoir of polluted water so then I can put like a storage container and put all of these slime things that I'm going to find around here so that they don't off gas like even if I wanted to build out here I'm going to get this and then that's annoying not a fan Game is a killer brain. Yeah. <laughs> you need big brain. Or it gives you big brain. After playing a lot. I'm still learning. I'll get there eventually. I think the way that I play, I just kind of do stuff. And then it will create an issue. And then I will solve the issue or attempt to anyway so i might not play like perfectly initially but i'll i'll get there eventually so i think i will make a bit of a power generation thing going here um oh there you are if i need to move it later i move it later so i'll chuck that and ah oh, yeah we need to refine it of course um where's the rock crusher hey we got a new skin i don't it's kind of hard to notice that Ooh. where's the good shit come on <laughs> i think that's all for the week we're done till friday Okay. Uh, we're going for that, are we? Where's the rock? Rock. Uh, Russia. Right. Let's get that first. I thought it was like a rock granulator. Did they change it? I think they changed it. So we'll get that. Food is going well. Oxygen is okay. We're probably going to need a um, scrubber, a skimmer. They changed that too, of course. <laughs> um, we'll just have them running together. I think this one, you can make like a little loop with the, the sieve as well. So maybe we'll make that down here. I remember doing that in previous games. And I have the blueprint of it, but I can't use it because it crashes the game. So I'll just have to use my, my intellect and recreate it. <laughs> I think you have to kind of prime it, like pump a little bit of water in there. Then once it has a bit, then it's fine. So, let's put a carbon skimmer in there. And a water sieve. Um, yeah, we'll rotate it. Hey. I'm gonna build it there. What? Thank you. Less invasive than a giant present in the corner. Eh, I don't know. See, like, I had a mod that automatically opened the present. I don't know if there's one like that for, for this game just yet, but. Alright, I'll leave it like that for the moment. And we can borrow a, a bit of this water. Just to prime it. That goes in there, then that goes in there, and then that goes back in there. Nice. And I will 
snip that for the moment so it doesn't run in until I'm ready. There is, it's against the rules. Why would it be against the rules? What a mod that automatically opens the skin when you get it. Because in DSD, I just, the present thing annoys me, and sometimes, you know, far away from a science machine or whatever it is, so I just have it. Like, what if I'm in the ruins and I get a present? I've got to build a machine to open it. Nah. Uh, ooh, a chef! Decrease excavation by three. That would be nice, but then I'm going to need another... Uh, I need more oxygen though. Not sure if I want that yet. <laughs> uh, I am going to hold off. I'm just going to leave it. <laughs> you can stay in the printing pod. Oh yeah, did we research the thing? We must have. Rock Crusher. You can go... There. Yeah. Exact reason to build an alchemy engine in the ruins? Just get the mod. It's so nice. I think it's a uh, skins extender. Highly recommend it. <laughs> I used to. I I'm pretty sure I downloaded it back when I was playing a lot of the gorge. And back then, if you got a skin in the gorge, you just you can't open it. Like there's no science machine. You can't build one, obviously. So it made a lot of sense. Still going with this. Okay, that's looking good. Built that. Hey, first time I catch you live. G'day Dirty, thank you very much for the four months. Appreciate it a lot. How you doing? Uh let's just make ten for the moment. Get that going, then I can make some smart batteries. This needs 200, so that's four? Yeah, so we should have enough. Oh, and do I need more research? Uh, maybe some fire poles? I don't know. I honestly, this stuff, this is like my favorite part of the game. Refining stuff and then oil and plastic. I love that stuff. I suck at it, but I love it <laughs> oh, Same with smart storage and transport. It's really cool On Vacation in the US. Oh nice Cool Never live when I'm awake. That's fair. Yeah, <laughs> makes sense. G'day, Tiny. Uh, what is this? Atmos sensor. I will need that. Where did I go wrong? I don't think we've gone wrong yet. Yet. We're getting there. <laughs> Alright, we can turn these on. Because they won't work anyway. Like getting carnival then quitting. I think I've 
I, there are like half the achievements I still haven't gotten. Um, if I have a look at my achievements. I have 42%. That's cool. In progress. There are no achievements in progress. I don't think. <laughs> I, I really like the update Steam has done to like fix the overlay and shit. It's really nice. Aha! Let's keep that up there too. Why is... it's weird. Alright, I think we can connect this, have a few blobs go in, and we disconnect it again. <laughs> we'll see how, how it goes. Might need a few more. I don't remember exactly. <laughs> nice. Yeah, it should be good, I think. Awesome. Produces more than it uses? Oh, okay. Well, in that case, I might need to... Make another uh, reservoir over here. Also, did I connect this one? It's just backed up. It's fine. It works. This seems good. Uh, I'll just turn that off actually. Seems good to me. So then they can finish building here. I need to actually reach it though. These farms are going well. I like it. We got plenty of food. Oxygen. Is, oxygen is good. We just have a lot of carbon dioxide that we need to get rid of. So. Okay. Uh, you didn't quite finish. <laughs> and we'll make a smart battery. Like so. That. Then we need one of those. It just works. Yeah. <laughs> that is that is me playing this game in a nutshell. As long as everything works, it doesn't matter. <laughs> it's all good. Going. We still got a fair bit of algae, which is nice. Yes, finish building that, please. Okay, it's the oxygen. Nice. So, with that done, we can snip that one. Goes in there. 
Nice. It would be good if like it filled that before it got moved on, but whatever. What's this? Red light, green light. Ah, yes. Of course. Okay. Uh. Hey, I remember it. Cool. Yeah, so this needs coal, of course. We're doing that. So when that is on, high threshold 100, low 0. This is 50 though. So let's have this 20 and that like 30, I don't know. Does it, well let's, we'll do 10 and 20, something like that. So then they, they don't have to run. Although, I mean, the difference between 20% and 10% is probably like 10 seconds. So they're probably gonna have to run it, at least until we can back this up with more batteries. This can hold 20. Just add a couple jumbo batteries and we should be good. Current load. The current load hovers at or just under what this produces, so we should be alright with just one. Hey, nice job. Okay, um, I think we can get in here now. I think. And I could even go into here because they'll come out with, they'll come out clean. Grab a few of these. Although the things that they bring with them, I'm not sure if they will be clean. <laughs> uh -huh. I don't know how to stop them from doing that though. Annoying. Why can't you line up with my grid? Silly game. This looks like the... No, never mind. Because I would love dust caps. They're so nice. They're a bit annoying to make though, so... Maybe not even for now. Alright, let's go through here. Oh shit. Uh, super hard digging. Do we have that? Who's the digger? You're the digger. You dig. Raid's got to do it. Eh? So we already had printables. Yeah, this is what we had before. <laughs> you try to trick me, game. Yeah, they still have to hold their breath though. But let's see, do they wash their hands? Bro! What? Why? Why? It has water. Does it need... It needs something else in there? <sighs> Why do I bother? It just needs water. Wash your damn hands.
No one uses it. Okay. Is it bugged again? I don't know. Maybe it's just bugged. I can't think of why they're not using it. Oh, if they're not germy, I see. I thought they just had to wash their hands no matter what. Okay, that makes sense. Okay, you can see the the level for the <laughs> the carbon dioxide is going down. Something is entombed. What's entombed? Oh, the hot tub. Of course. Well, I look forward to having that message there for a long time. Got sulfur and sucrose. Name is out of stock. Uh, oh, we can get one more, actually. Get one more. G'day, Vu. Okay, there you go. So, they should use that. Should we get in there, then? A bit of bioscan. Why not? Alright, let's get a... You can be Nicola. There you go. <laughs> you are the builder. Haven't got a name yet. You get that name. <laughs> That's the name you get. Over a database entry by inspecting facility ruin. I did? I don't remember that. Ah, oh, I just opened the door, I guess. Alright, let's have a look. I searched the computer, storing what useful data I can find. Ah. Huh. If there is room available after the necessary scientific and survival knowledge has been uploaded, I'll see what I can do. Director Stern. Director, I've been thinking, and it occurs to me that our subjects will, mo uh, will likely travel outside our range of radio contact when establishing new colonies. Colonies travel into the cosmos as representatives of humanity. And I believe it is our duty to preserve the planet's non-scientific knowledge in addition practical information. I'd like to make a formal request that comprehensive arts and cultural histories make their way onto the microchip databases. There's Dr. Broussard. Okay. Look at this dude. <laughs> it's a morb. Passing gas. Thanks, morb. Uh, we should probably kill him since he uh, excretes polluted oxygen although he has a nice to call below 100k yeah oh, no <laughs> well i mean it's not like you can get another dupe so i kind of like him he's nice but he, he does have to go we can someone can use the neural vacillator which is cool oh boy that's a long one i'm not reading that <laughs> Oof! <laughs> Just explodes. Or cannot be manually controlled. <laughs> what you mean? Go in there, I guess. 
And what is this? A pinch of pepper knot. Nice. I like them. I will just check on the germs. So they're just gonna get killed by the chlorine when they do eventually meet the chlorine. Um, I should have checked if they washed their hands. I didn't, I wasn't paying attention. And how come we still can't see what this is? A bit annoying. What if I deconstruct that? I'm pretty sure I know what it is, but I want to have it uncovered. Alright, Vu is going to come and open it. <laughs> like, yeah, what of it? I did that. <laughs> and you go in there. Um. Still unknown. What if I build a ladder? Can you do that? Okay, fine. Oh boy. This gives me a bad feeling. I can't stop you if you insist on going forward with this, but I ask that you remove me from the project. Yikes. Hey, we got some stuff in the locker. Nice. Get someone to rummage in there. See what we can find. I like that there is lore in this game. But I'm not a huge fan of lore that you just read. Like that's how you learn. You just read it. April, can you go there? Why? I gotta like stand in it? Can't even build there. Come on, game. Uh, what do we find in here? Snazzy suit and a warm sweater. Cool. Um, well, someone can can wear those, I guess. Uh, I guess Guav has the highest requirement. Guav and Parade. Okay, so you can wear the snazzy suit. Decor 30. Nice. Can be upgraded to Primo Garb. I've never heard of that. <laughs> nice. Clothing refashionator. What? Oh, wow. Cool. I don't really want to give anyone the warm sweater because then they might get too warm. I don't know. Don't want them to get hot. Ew. Fabricator accepts mutant seeds. Alright, um... A lot have been... Yeah, a lot has been added. Like, heaps. I'm trying to think of the best way to go about doing stuff here. Yikes. That ain't great. <laughs> I guess I can put all of the slime in here because it's chlorine so it'll be fine but then if I if I build down here I'm going to release the chlorine to the bottom so that's a bit annoying I guess for now I will just put a storage bin here and it'll be fine.
It'll be fine. And then that can hold all of this slime. Everything that I've built seems to be working well enough, so I'm pretty happy. Feed. Those aren't seeds. Feed. Uh, one. We have sleep wheat grain, or we can see it somewhere. Okay. April earned a skill point. Hell yeah. Uh, I'm going to leave you like that for now. Thank you very much for the follow. Um, in here we go... Organic? Oh, maybe I don't have any slime. That's probably why I can't put it in there yet. But we should also put the things that are off gas, like polluted dirt and rot pile, I think, go in there. Boo. Have a good one. G'day lit. New colon? I know. <laughs> it was overdue. I don't know. I reckon I can just get in there and not worry too much about it. If we end up with slime lung, then we'll, we'll deal with it. <laughs> Famous last words. I just want to open it up, you know. There's no slime lung in the air. It's only polluted oxygen, so that should be fine. <laughs> or I might just need a few of those... Uh, Deodorizers, or whatever they're called. Deodorizer? Deodorizer. Ah, we got slime. Okay. Slime. So, chuck that in there. Someone is sick, but it's only food poisoning, so that's fine. We don't worry too much about that. And I wonder if I should... We'll keep this going. But... I might want to move this water in here. If that's possible. Ooh, actually. I should keep this in line here. Do that. If I can. They're probably gonna have to dip into the water. <laughs> oh well. But I wanna leave space, just in case. That goes there, and here I'll probably put a insulated tile on this side. Just to keep all that stuff out of there. And then we might need, um, we might need some exosuits to be able to get the rest of that. It's fine. It's fine. 
Ah, uh, see, this is shit. That has to go underwater. I don't know how else to do that. I could put it underwater here, but then I don't know if this will give it germs. Alternatively, I could put a deodorizer, but then I have to keep going back to that, and that's kind of annoying. Hmm. I don't know. I could go to this water here and put it in there. Is there any slime lung around here? Yeah, it's fine. Not any more than that. what's around there. They can do that. Been like underwater there. Oh, look at the little Paku. Well, I've earned a skill point. Uh, material study? We're not going to need that for a long time. Okay. Dig down deeper. Uh, how does that help? Plane? <laughs> CO2. Ah, oh, yeah, I mean, CO2 is fine. I'm not worried about that. Um, just the polluted stuff. It's like, ideally I want to put this underwater so then it can't make any more. I probably will do that. Hello, what are you guys talking about? Oh, you have downtime, I see. I like, what are you slacking for? Uh... Put them on the water, no off gas. Yeah, I'm working on it. Okay, so... Polluted dirt, there's gonna be a lot of that. Yeesh. We're probably gonna need some... Deodorizers in here anyway. Do you get off-gassing just from the water? You do. Well, I guess you can't, you can't have everything. <laughs> it's better than nothing. Just put that there. And this needs power now, doesn't it? Eh. I mean, this is like outside, so it's fine. What did you get? Building ranges? What does that do? I'm intrigued. Uh, yeah, they can build that. There's the range. Yeah, but what do you mean building? Buildings have range? Oh, hello. <laughs> yeah. 
Um, yeah, we'll keep it open. Why not? What? How does the range work? I've never heard of buildings having range. What does that mean? I thought that they would just go and do whatever they need to do, no matter how far it is. Press some Discord. Okay, thank you. Uh, is there anything I should be heading towards? I think we have most of the basics covered at this point. So I want fire poles, but eh, I can live without fire poles. And then there's oil stuff and ranching stuff. Like a water pump shows which tiles it actually pumps. Okay, I think I get you. Yeah, we might leave the the research for the moment. Too much. Oh, but a tiny bit of slime lung. It'll get. It'll go away. Um, I guess I should. I should use this. Who did I say needed it? The research. We'll give it to Guav then. <laughs> Jeans shuffled. Yeah. Uh, regenerative. Ooh, health plus 20 per cycle. I mean, like, as if you're going to be fighting shit. Come on. <laughs> I like the, the sunny disposition one. That one's nice. Oh, well. You can recharge it, but I don't have the thing to recharge with. Can I mine this? Yeah! Nice. That's good. That's fairly good. But this is working very well. I guess like, I don't need any kind of at most switches because like it'll only work if there is carbon dioxide so I don't need to really worry about that. It's handy. Yeah. <laughs> One day it will grow into an adult puffed morph puffed prince. Then we got a Paku. Yeah, things are going well. I'm happy with my little colony. Got some slime. All right, uh, anything useful? Four fungal spores. Okay. 
unfortunately, that's kind of tricky to grow. Oh, yeah. And... Wait, can they not... They can't build it either. Bang. Just like sweep out all of the, the polluted water. They will become king. Can they actually? Is there a puffed king? <laughs> Squeaky puffed. Dense puffed. Oh boy. What do they do? Oxalite. Oh, that's it. Okay. <laughs> Because I know they did add like a bunch of critter things since the last time I played. Wait a second. One, two, three, four. Yes. One, two, three, four. Hey. Oh. <laughs> I didn't count correctly. <laughs> Come on. Well, <sighs> why, why do I do this? King Charlie, I see. It lines up with this, strangely enough. Am I just gonna leave it? Uh, I feel like eventually I will change it, but. Use the bottom of the ladder to drop the water. This is- I want to keep my water in here. Instead of mopping. Oh, you mean drop the water here instead of here? <laughs> They're just gonna keep mopping and put him back in there. It's a shame that this can't pick it up before it spreads. I guess I could make like a little lip there. Like a little thing like that. Maybe that would help. Yeah, that seems to work. <laughs> Let's just put it back in there. Nice. Okay. Very good. Water could have germs. Oh, 
I just don't want it to off gas. Because if you have it in the bottle, it just makes all of this shit come out of it, which is really annoying. Unless there's a better way to deal with it. Like... 5 kilos. Get luck, yucky lungs. Yeah. But I think it's also a little bit dangerous because I've kind of invited a little bit of slime lung in. So, I don't know. Uh, let's kill this guy. Look, at the end of the day, no one's going to die from it, but, eh. If I can keep it contained, I'll, I'll do that. You're right, it probably is easier to just keep it in the reservoir and then put deodorizers. That's probably much better. I kind of want to go here and just dig out that stuff so the message will go away. <laughs> what do we got? Oh, we have another one here. Damn. Eh? Oh, yeah. Wait, what? I have to stand on all three of them? What if I just deconstruct your automation? <laughs> then what will you do? Alright, get a better look at this biome. Not a whole lot going on besides the slush geyser. That is going to help so much. Man. Much better than that, dude. Is this the... No, I don't think it is. I keep... When I see this, I think of the um, thermo nullifier. I don't think that would fit in there. There's something here. Um, wait, where is it? Ah, oh, did they get rid of it? <laughs> Just to be able to see what it was. Uh, the range mod. I, I'm not going to install it straight away, but I will have a look. I'm still... I, I want to get my blueprint mod working, if I can. Because I kind of need that soon-ish. Alright, now we can release all this. Uh, let's, we'll build from the top down. Dig from the top down. The blueprint mod? Uh, this one. Oh. <laughs> that one. Damn it. Rookie mistake. Just lets you make a blueprint and then you can paste it. Because I have like all of my oxygen setups and stuff saved on that. Maybe those saves have gotten corrupted, I don't know. Never heard of that mod? Really? 
it saves you from having to like rebuild stuff that you're you're gonna rebuild anyway. I have like the a couple of different Rodriguez things saved on that. Because I always forget how to make them or what I need to do. But yeah, obviously it's not working at the moment, so I'll have to go and see what's going on. Blueprint for Factorio and like planning from the start. Yeah, it's nice. The good thing about the mod is you can even, you can build things that you don't have access to yet. So, and it will just like stay as, as the little grayed out thing until you can. I think it's really good for those kind of complicated setups that you need in most bases like the steam turbine shit and the electrolyzer stuff and you know oil setups and boilers and things like that if you if you know that you're going to be building them again and again and again you just like build a really nice one copy it and then you can just like paste it in different worlds just save so much time and effort Alright, we got some skill points, but I'm not sure this one could be good. Give you guys those ones. And where's our, our digger is already good. I could give him like extra carrying and stuff, but I don't know. Oh yeah, is that different now? It's different now. Oh. Glow stick emits low amounts of rads and light. Interesting. <laughs> Super duper hard digging. What, they have decreased science, but they are science. Come on, man. Plus 400, minus 150. Bruh. Oh no, minus 120, minus 30 skill leveling. Low stick is nice with rad eater. I think I will get some tablets. <laughs> Thank you very much. Okay, so do I want to fix the levels on this so that it's not... Uh, Three and then four. I think I do. That's going to be really annoying. Since I need to move everything one step lower. But it's better that I do it now. Or I build even more. think there's there's nothing even in there it's fine it'll just it should all stay in the pipes okay 
So, Emma. And then this. Yeah, and then we gotta get, we're gonna have to remove the pipes. Oh well. Ooh. It's all right, we have this there so we can easily release some more. No problemo. Is this dirty water now? I think it's okay. Oh yeah, we're not doing... Are we doing research? Mm, I don't think so. They, have they put things in here? They've put a few things. 200 kilos. But how much slime do we have? Yeah. We need to put more. Come on, guys. Make it a higher priority. this too. What a pain. That's what I get for not being able to count. <laughs> Keep track of those. Four, so it's not even enough to really farm anyway, and they go really slowly too. And I would also like to keep track of what are they called? Thimble reed fiber, <sighs> reed fiber, my nemesis. <laughs> Hell yeah. It's chilly. Oh yeah, I'm gonna have to do this too. What? Oh, it's power wise. We saved it. Um, so this, we need to connect that back up again. Let some water go through. Boop, boop, boop. Nice, that's good enough. And snap that off. All right, we still got 54,000. That's a lot of food. Oxygen, ah, oh, look at the oxygen, killing it, just crushing it. Algae, still 25 tons, very good. All right, I'm content. I would like to build a little bit more in this direction. I'm just 
scared of going into here. I want to do what I've done on this side, the same on this side. Can at least do that. Hey. this. <laughs> what have I done? So if I get down here, I should be able to start moving this water. Yo? How did, <laughs> how did you get there? Fuck it out. How did you manage that? It, I... How did... I don't even know how you got in there. It's all closed off. <laughs> what? Magic. Yeah, you have hypothermia. Well, okay. and you brought food with you. What? <laughs> Maybe I should check out what this is while I'm here. Is that the thermo nullifier? understand how to get in here. I can't build in there, but I need to build in there to be able to see in there. Maybe I'll dig like that. Hello? Uh, don't sleep? Can you... Oh god. It's breathable. Oh shit. Um. How do I get you out of here? Can't. Aren't you supposed to like go and find a place to breathe? Bruh, come on. <laughs> what? That was very quick. No, I'm going back. <laughs> what the heck was that? Uh... 14. Okay. I, I don't even understand how they got in there. That's bullshit. Have to keep an eye on you. Okay. Entombed. Oh yeah, it's a building, that's fine. I was like, how did you get stuck already? <laughs> Okay, so digging it should be fine. I don't know how you can get stuck doing that. I 
That's it. Ah, oh, we need to do this again. Oh, maybe you... No, I don't know. <laughs> I'm still confused. Maybe you fell down and then they built on... T I don't know. It's fine this time. Whee! Oh. Oh. Okay, fine. Wash your hands. Okay. Open the wardrobe. Ah, <laughs> uh, oh, you have to actually make outfits. <laughs> Ooh. Yikes. That is not great. Um, I think I will leave this for the moment. <laughs> I need more skins if I want to make a nice looking outfit. Finish the coat. Uh, kind of. I, I got to, I killed all the bosses, including the final boss, and I haven't gone much further than that. Actually, no, I did two of the bishops, but it was, it was a bit of a slog. I'll probably just, I'll finish the extra content in my own time. But for all intents and purposes, it's finished, yes. these things. Spindly grub fruit. Okay, um, I think we're all good in this area now. We can start digging it out. Let's just go like that. Pitcher pump is going to have to go a lot lower anyway, so... Uh, buildings... And then I'll build a pump in here. Build a pump in there. And we'll move the, the water from there out into here. And I'm going to have to rebuild my coal. Rebuild a smart battery. Rebuild this. Okay. Slime lung. Oh no, Guav. <laughs> no. What does that do? Um... Breath is minus 1% per second, athletics minus 3. That's fine. I mean, you're not going to die. It's just a bit inconvenient. Um, 
where if, where did you even get that from in there? I guess. Uh, slime lung dies in oxygen, doesn't it? But it lives in the polluted oxygen, so. <laughs> yeah, constantly going in there, that'll, that'll probably do it. That would do it. And I can grab the water from there too. that has to go in here. Couple bridges. One bridge. Bent. Very nice. Um, so we have, uh, someone's got hypothermia, and someone's got slime lung. Don't we have some curative tablets? Where did they go? Do I have to assign them? Tab. Yeah, we've got three curative tablets. Um. Ah, oh, it's only for food poison. Okay. Should I make an apothecary? Get rid of this. I uh, should probably clean up those pipes too. Or I could even, I'll just get rid of it. It'll fall down into here, I think. build that down here. So it's not even needed for this. We just got some water sitting in there. Maybe when we eventually get a plumber I'll clean it. <laughs> but it's not going anywhere. It's not hurting anyone so. We don't really have a need for water. If I'm not growing bristle berries, or I don't remember if the dust caps needed water either, but yeah. Let's go on the mill lice, mill wood. Fine. All good. Uh, fertilizer. Oh, husbandry. Hmm. Or a, an artist. No cooking, no researching, falls asleep. We already have someone who falls asleep. Eh, an artist might not be the worst, you know. We would need some more oxygen though, I think. Lindsay is a charming woman, unless you make the mistake of messing with one of her friends. Okay. Yeah, it should be fine. Right, it should be fine. Get some art up in here. How many? We've got three units of reed fiber, so that's for paintings. But we can make sculptures. And that would make people a little bit happier. Oh, 
I'll we'll just do it like that. And then I can put a painting above them too. I'll just get rid of them all. It fits perfectly. How many is that? Five. Ah, shit. <laughs> um, <laughs> we need another, another bedroom. I uh, well, someone can live down there for the moment. Sorry. My apologies, the accommodation is not quite up to the standard, but it should be good enough for the time being. And I guess I could move this a level lower. We might even need a second one, but move that lower for the time being. And we're not doing any research, but we can go through here now. Expand. So is this 20 tiles? It is. Cool. And then that can go over here. Next to other science things. Hey. Thank you. Uh, was this crafting station? Yeah, you know, I'm going to get rid of that. I don't think we crafted a single thing. We don't even know how to craft anything. So then this can just be a second bedroom. Oh boy. Okay, it's slightly above the level. Uh, let's just displace a little bit of stuff in there then it goes lower thank you sorry that was my bad okay should be good now And let's future-proof this a little bit. I think we will eventually have 10 dupes. Get some oxygen coming right down or right up from the bottom. Oh yeah. There's that. Do that. need some people who work well at night. I normally get a few of them. And we'll add in a pitcher pump. Uh, I don't need one at the moment, but we will need one eventually. Cool. Alright, that's starting to look a bit better now. Insufficient oxygen, by how much? Oof, a good hundred. Yeah, it's because we have an extra dupe, okay. So, um, we might need a second one then. That is bad news for our algae, of which we have 28 tons. The algae is essentially a timer. When that runs out, you're stuffed. So you need to have something sorted out by then. <laughs> um... Thankfully, I think my water is my water is okay, and I can make electrolyzers from that, so it should be fine. I just hope that I can get my blueprint mod working by then. Um, well, is there anything else that I would need? Uh, 
for that. Might need more power. Conductive wiring, heavy watt, and all that. So let's get those. Do I need a fridge? How much can a fridge even hold? A uh, hundred kilos. And how much can this hold? 150. And it's 82 out of 150. So, that's alright. How much power? 120. It's like, that's 120 watts constantly gone, you know? You'll never, you'll never not use the fridge. Hello? <laughs> what are you doing? Why don't you work on the artwork? Oh, you need a hat. That's why, okay. Lindsay. Get you your art training. Fundamentals in art. So you can make some fairly average sculptures. <laughs> Fridges only charge 10 watts when all the food is cooled. Really? Oh. Yikes. What the fuck is that? Inexplicable. Oh. Oh, I can just... Oh, that's cool. Try again. <laughs> this current artwork allows a skilled duplicate to create artwork of their choice. I mean, does this give any decor benefit? Honestly, mobs could have done better. I mean, hey, you get 16.5, it's all right. When you get better skill, I'll, I'll repaint them all, so you can do more. What is this circuit? 780. Might need a second one. But then that's gonna, that's gonna blow the circuit, isn't it? Then it'll be over a thousand. Not good. I think at the moment most things aren't operating all the time. I should also look at the colony report. Um, where's like the food? Calorie generation. Yeah, so every few days when it grows. <laughs> Calorie consumption. Uh, it's roughly six, seven thousand a day. And we make twelve thousand every handful of days. Okay. I'll keep an eye on it. It's about fifty seven thousand. If it goes down too much, I might need to add an extra row. Uh, let's also make make one of these. For clean water. Yeah, nice. Advanced power regulation. Aha! Heavy watt. I like it. Because um, if I'm really keen, I could even start doing this. Also, how full is this? I could add a hydroponic tile and grow some of these just with whatever polluted water we get. Because I do need them. Maybe I will. Do I have... Uh, Read seed. 
Super reed seed. I'd have three. Okay. Be handy. One. <laughs> Actually, no. I'm not even going to put it there. I'm going to put it like right here. <laughs> so then it can go straight from here. Well, kind of. Bro. Thank oh, it's right at the end, okay. <laughs> Alright, well, I guess I'll make a fridge then. If a fridge is, is a good thing to do. And worst case scenario, I mean, even if it doesn't have power, it still can hold more per tile than that can. Medicine. We don't need to put medicine in there. Hmm. Cooling contents. Okay. Energy saver. 20 watts. Cool. I honestly didn't know. It is, I don't know if that's a recent change. That's pretty cool. Makes sense. Oh, we got a little baby. Oh, <laughs> they're cute. Yeesh. Gold amalgam, huh? What are you doing? <laughs> Digging in the dirt. Uh, we already have someone. No, we have a... We have a machine? Machinist? I think we do. I think I'll take the gold amalgam. Thank you. No hard feelings. Um, so if we're going that, we can dig that out and close that off. Research. Conductive wiring. Cool. We should probably get some more copper then. Oh, what is this? Gold. We can also make gold and iron. Nice. 24 times, 26 and a half. Okay. Good. So four fungal spores. I really would like to be able to grow that. Wait, where did the reed fiber go? Oh, I see. <laughs> They're a little bit too quick. That's fine. So if I wanted to make some exosuits and that's going to need its own circuit because that needs like, yeah, 480 watts. Okay, so we're going to need a second one. Second one of these. And this is going to have to be connected separately. 
Not liking it. Hey. So I guess this can handle like that kind of stuff and then maybe this can go for more of the higher things like up there. Like so. Okay, I'll let you finish that first. Hey, it's grown. These grow pretty quickly too. So, uh, two cycles in domestic growth. It just they they drink so much water, so much polluted water. Oh, we finished all the research that we had to do. Very nice. Maybe we'll start learning this stuff. Then we can tap into the natural gas. Okay, that's connected to all that stuff, and I reckon I snip it off there, and now we got to dig that out. We still got heaps of space down here. Plenty of algae, plenty more coal and copper if I need. And I still haven't found the teleporter for for humans. I'm surprised. Wonder where it is. Go in here too. Yes. Bigger maps? I mean... I understand that the map is big, but I, I normally find it fairly close to where I start. Maybe I was just lucky those times. I mean, not that I would even go out anyway, but it's just kind of cool an interesting concept. I like having two bases and <laughs> having like one major base and a little colony and having different terrains and shit. It's such a cool idea for a DLC. Went to gym, ate dinner, shower, we're still alive. Nice. Good stuff, going to gym. Respect. Fossil fuels, natural gas, oil refinery, petroleum generator. Alrighty. Um, I think I would want some exosuits before I go in here. Because if they're going to be working in this kind of area, it's like, it's going to be hot. It's going to get warmer. They're not going to be able to breathe. So it would be nice. What is this? Oh yeah, we couldn't see. We'll see what that is too. So I might put some extra suits here. I mean, it makes sense. Love spaced out. Funny you should mention colonies. Why is it funny? Eh? <laughs> What's so funny about it? Uh, I keep forgetting that I need to build the liquid lock after the exo suits. So you go in your exosuit, then you go through the liquid lock. That is the smart way to do it, right? <laughs> so let's do that.
I mean, I guess when I built this, I wasn't planning on having the exosuit thing right here. Um, so is this all good? The circuits there. Circuits there. That has 960. That has, yeah, it's roughly half. We'll probably need a third one just for the exosuits. They're fucking massive. All right, well, while that's happening, I ah, see, look, we already got one. Awesome. That'll, that'll take a while and we need a proper oxygen setup for that too. Um, wait, so which was the circuit that had less on it? This one, the bottom one. Okay. So let's connect the exosuit forge to that too. I could put it down here, but then they might have to hold their breath a bit. <laughs> um, I'll just chuck it here, that's fine. I'll be a little loud while they sleep. Asking what would happen to the flag since it has a Union Jack on it. His answer was we have a bunch of Royalists. Well, we won't, we won't change our flag until we become a Republic. Because like he's, there's still a King. Still part of the, the monarchy. The Commonwealth and shit. I think we should leave. I don't not really understand why we're still hanging around. I guess it, like it's hard to to leave things that are so established. I think it would be a good time for it. Ah, uh, let's take that too. It's not going to grow there anyway, so. at you April I wonder if I should get them little things like improved carrying might help them speed up stuff they all have enough skill for it enough skill points so won't make them too unhappy come out yeah I mean we had a, a referendum like a, a big vote on it in I think it was the year 2000 and it was it was only just that we decided to say to stay on or something like that I don't know I was I was too young when that happened I don't really remember it but I don't know I think if we had another one today most the majority would say to leave maybe they're not doing it because like that, that would be a lot of work <laughs> it's like, oh fuck, we've got to change all the money, to change all the names. Like, we have, we have so many things that are like Royal this, or Prince this, or Queen Elizabeth this, or... Like, one of the main roads in the CBD is Elizabeth Street, so... I don't know if they can be bothered changing it. Uh... Let's like build a couple ladders so they can get rid of this. I'm 
some tiles up there. And there. I've seen some people say that they, they're happy staying in the monarchy just because, you know, they, they just don't care. <laughs> like, it's not worth the effort to change. And I, I can kind of understand that. Back from dentist. Nice. You need any work done? I hate going to the dentist. I haven't been in a while, I should probably go again. Cure a sick duplicate of disease. Hey, nice. Oh, someone had food poisoning. <laughs> Oopsie. Check it doesn't have slime on. Okay, good. Tea for perfection? Wow, nice. Ice? What? I want ice? Suit wearing? I mean, I just got a dupe, so I I am gonna say no thank you. Thanks, but no thanks. <laughs> just chilling. Um, maybe I should make a, like a kitchen and a mess hall. Place for them to eat and stuff. That can go down there. I should have put it there in the first place. tables and I normally put a water cooler in there just for fun can hang some plants maybe put some, some ugly sculptures put a little water cooler in the middle yeah. Would you have to change things or would it give you the option to not follow them? Well, I don't know. It's like, it, wouldn't it be weird to have like the king or queen on your money if you're, if they're no longer relevant? So we got that. Let's do some shipping. I mean, all of these things will be far into the future, but. Atmosu checkpoint. So. You go through there. Yes, that's what I want. And then you get the atmosphere dock. Ah, I need more metal. Okay. <laughs> that was quick. Probably even more than that, but. And let's disable that, because otherwise they're not going to go through. You eat while streaming. Um, I normally stream for about five hours and then I'll eat after. So by the end of my stream, it's it's time to eat. 
I was going to make some some stuff in advance and if I if like I ate during stream then I could stream longer potentially but then I I didn't make stuff <laughs> What's for lunch? Eh, not sure. What is it today? Monday. I don't know. Maybe some eggs. I I basically will have either eggs, noodles, like migoring, ramen, or jaffles. That, that is, those are like the four things that I eat for lunch <laughs> and then just rotate through if I don't make anything in advance. Also, um, I have, I should be updating the schedule. Do you guys say schedule or schedule? I don't know what I say. I think I say both. So three on each. Okay. Um, a little bit more and then we're done here. Okay. Cooking stream? <laughs> yeah, you get to watch me do really intensive cooking like boiling water, putting noodles in the pot. Wow, like it's so hard. <laughs> Sometimes I stir it. Oh, and don't forget when I set the timer. That's the hardest part. Have I learned anything new here? Berry sludge. No, I can't make that. Does this count as a room? Yeah, so like they get a nice morale bonus. Alright, who sits where? Lindsay, Guav, Utazuta sit together. Parade and April sit together and Vu sits on his own. <laughs> um, let's make... We'll make Lindsay sit over here. Just so that you guys can sit together. <laughs> Boiling water stream would be fire. Come on, man. Alright, um, we're gonna need one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Look at this. This is cool. It, why? It's like not even necessary, but I like it. <laughs> um, we'll do five. We'll do five for now. Not that they can make them anyway, but we'll, that's what we'll do. We need oxygen as well. Like a, a big oxygen setup to make more. Do I stand in front of the burner? Yeah. Pretty much. Sometimes I'll sit down and I'll I'll look at my phone. <laughs> uh, thank you, Bard, for the follow. You guys can watch me roll through Instagram. <laughs> yeah, it's riveting content, isn't it? I guess it's you, that's why I couldn't make any more. But now this is all this is all oxygen. Is there any pollution? Oh yikes, what the heck? It's dying. It'll I mean there's no pollution in here, so it will die. Except for that one tile. Just gotta give it some time. Cause I was gonna remove this, but I'll wait till the the pathogens die. Okay. I want to fill this tile. I want to see both arms of water before I stop putting more in there. An untapped market. <laughs> Just streaming like really boring content.
I remember, it's funny, um, before my YouTube channel, like the Demon Rebuilt channel, I had like two or three other channels where I just did like the, the most random shit. There was one channel where I put like music that got copyrighted. There was another channel where I did like random fucking, I don't know, skits or whatever. Basically just throwing anything at the wall to see what would stick. And there was one one video where I was like, what if I just make the most boring whatever? And maybe it will be like so bad that it will be popular. <laughs> I don't know, like become some random viral video. Cause like you don't know what becomes successful. <laughs> so I was like, let me just film my dog or something for like half an hour and just have him like not do a single thing and uh it got like two views something like <laughs> i don't think it exists anymore so don't don't look for it <laughs> don't like liquid locks tell me any way that happens in a, in real life well, you reckon this game is realistic? Where are you going? Oh, you're putting stuff in there, okay. That's fine. I just want to see it hit this tile. Come on. You watch, it's going to overflow here first, isn't it? Wow, we already made one. Fucking hell, that was quick. Also, why did they add durability? Why did they add durability to the Atmo suits? Come on! Who came up with that idea? Please. What a shit idea. <laughs> they used to just last forever. No, not yet. Although well, the water has slime lung, is a bit concerning. Is there? There's no slime lung in here. Okay. I should make. Fucking hell! I should make some Atmo sensors. Do we stop making more stuff? Yikes. Let's uh, let's just keep it going until I feel like we have enough. We're we're low on the reed fibers anyway, so they can't do anything there. There's durability. Yeah, <laughs> eventually they break, and then you have to go back here and repair them. <laughs> I mean, the repairing is cheap. It's just like one reed fiber, but it's still annoying. Come on, there's probably, maybe there's too much pressure on this side, 5.5 .5 kilos, <laughs> maybe. Alright, look, I'm gonna, I'm gonna turn it off. Oh, it just stops immediately, fine. Lindsay. Never have much of that in the best of my games. I mean, all you need is like one of these. To me, it's it's like the equivalent of Vault Goat Horns. Once you have a little farm set up, you will have enough reed fiber for the rest of the game. It might take a little bit of time to get it going. But, like, you only really need it for clothes, and that's it. So, like, once everyone has a suit, then you don't need more, really. Maybe that's why they they made the suits break, because otherwise you're not going to be using a whole lot. Have I ever had a damaged building? I've had a damaged building, yeah. But they don't 
break from wear and tear, they break from like incorrect materials and stuff, right? Um I don't have the the gas stuff set up, but I'll need that eventually. I need to fix my mod before I build that, so that's what's going to happen. We already have an artist. Thank you. Not a very good one, but we have one. <laughs> Maybe I can upgrade them. Lindsay. We need better art. Mediocre artwork quality. Alright, I'll take it. Aesthetic design. Repaint them. Why does it say repaint? Like, not a painting. Is there a way that I can do this quickly? All of them? Is there a repaint button? Alright, let's see what you can do now. I guess this is also kind of good, like if you want a specific one and you get the wrong one, instead of having to rebuild it, you can just tell them to build again. Try again. Looking at only beginner guys and most of them being like 30 minutes. I remember there was one guy. Wait. Bro, this is the same. Lindsay. Ow! Fundamentals? Wait a second. You have aesthetic design. Lindsay, please! Make better ones. Lindsay! <laughs> Oh, for fuck's sake. Is it like a chance? Um, yeah, as I was saying, I remember there were Oxygen not included videos that I've seen on YouTube with like an hour and a half guides of like just a beginner guide an hour and a half videos. <laughs> I think it was Magnet makes videos like that that are just super long. But you watch him and like surely he, ha he says things that aren't necessary. It's like, no, it's all kind of useful. <laughs> the game is just, it has that much stuff. Eh, now it's out of water. I'm disappointed in this. I don't understand. Why is it crude? Can they only do crude things unless I destroy it and rebuild it? Let's try. Let's destroy it and rebuild it. Can I say someone I watch with guides? Sure. again. Ah, uh, Francis John, yes. I, I watched the... They did a video where they wanted to get like the meat eating achievement. And that was very cool. I watched that playthrough. Is he still playing Oni? I haven't checked on his channel in ages. Yeah, you've seen it too, Keizo? Nice. <laughs> Honestly, that playthrough was like, damn, this ranching thing is kind of cool. Get so much food out of it. And um, I, built my, I built my auto killing setups based on that too. 
like where you make like a little pond and they fall in there and then you move the eggs out man such a good idea <laughs> ah here we go it's quaint is that the one that i rebuilt i thought i rebuilt this one maybe it's just a chance I don't know. Oh, cool music. I kill them, just set attack. Everyone shots them. But why need? You don't need to. Just drop them in the water as eggs, and when they hatch, they just die, and then the meat gets transported away into your fridge. It's it's honestly exquisite. It's a sight to behold when it when it works perfectly. <laughs> I'm a big fan of autom automation. As much as I suck at doing it and like setting it up, when it works and just everything runs on its own without you needing to touch it, that's that's just a such a great feeling. All right, we can get rid of all of this now. Cool. Um, should we jump in here? See what's going on? Say howdy. Ah, there you are. <laughs> Found it. Discovered a functioning teleportation device with a pre programmed destination. It appears to go to another planetoid, and I'm fairly certain there's a return device on the other end. Fairly certain. <laughs> I could send a duplicate through safely if I decide. Alright, let's see. Where are we heading? Yuckalin! <laughs> what? Why? I don't want to go there. Uh, boulders, metals, light, radiation, natural gas, liquid sulfur, carbon dioxide, hydrogen, but oil! Got oil. I like oil. Upper meteor. Ah, oh, they do have meteors. And ice and slimy meteors. Ah, oh, it's got rust and oil. Cool. Let's have a look. Ah, there we are. <laughs> okay, cool. I know these planets are much smaller than your main one. Um great okay well that's that's there robotic arm ceiling robot can i inspect the ceiling robot no i can't no oh. i like it that's cool excited about finding oil yeah I feel like BP <laughs> yuckling come on well, I don't understand why can I not see in there <laughs> Just go there! <laughs> Thank you. Oh, it's another one of them. Cool. Okay, well, you discovered it, so you can go sit in there. Why not? I remember once, I didn't realize that it would, like, you had to complete the process yourself. And I just had someone sitting there for, like, two days. That was my bad. 
Uh, deep Divers Longs. Nice. Alright. That's pretty good. That's like half of a dupe in terms of oxygen. Big fan of glossy Dracos. Ah, yes. Right. I could do some ranching, you know, at some point in the near future. Uh, let's keep building these rooms. Got the space for it. See, look at this water. We, we actually got a really nice asteroid. Got this ready, ready to go. Gonna have to clear out the water though. I need, probably need like all of this space to use it. Oh, you know what we can do? My, one of my favorite things to do is just fill out this area with fucking gas storage bins. I should probably research them. Um, what are they called? Gas, gas. Gas, 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 gas. Ah, eh, that one. Yeah, gas reservoir. I I showed my old file at the beginning of the stream, just very briefly, and I kid you not, I can't zoom out, but I had an area like this big, just filled with gas reservoirs, full of natural gas. <laughs> so good. And they filled too. They they filled up. Yes, reservoirs, my beloved. Um, you know what I might do? We need more polluted oxygen for this to grow. So it might be not the worst idea to take some out of here or here. I don't know. Um, maybe we'll we'll get these. Go oh, well. I need. I have two, so we can get through at least once we get oxygen. It's like you need this to get that, and then you need that to get that, and then you need that. Yeah. And on we go. Food poisoning. Oh, food. What are you eating mushrooms for? Where do we even get mushrooms from? <laughs> We got good food. You know, that's that's kind of on you, man. That's on you. Where is the mushroom? Oh, mushroom is better than what we're eating. Okay, never mind. <laughs> Nobody here. Okay. I I should make a grill and a kitchen. Yeah, I think I I'm with you, Kazo, on this. <laughs> I tried once with the the slicksters, but they were too slow and I was just like oil. Give me the oil. Give me the oil. Um, I think this planet might even have oil on it. Is there a way that I can check the planet? Not Yakulin. What is it? Pastorilios. It's a Greek planet. Um, water, volcano, salt slush. No, no oil. Dang. Alright, well, we'll have to go to Yuckalin. <laughs> Get some oil. Who's the artist? Uh, I think it's Lindsay. It did a couple good ones. <laughs> Most of them, not so nice. 
I don't know. I feel like if you can make quaint statues, why can you still make shit ones? Like, your skill exceeds that level. You shouldn't be able to make the worst ones. What about here? Oh, for fuck's sake. It's like, imagine having the, the masterworks trait. You can make the best statues and then you just make like a shit one. I don't know. I don't get it. Have I used the radiation generators? Very, very briefly. That's something that will be getting into this playthrough at some point, I guess. Alright, but I think that is going to be it for me. Do need to go and eat some food. But it was a good start. We'll be back tomorrow. Keep it going. So if that's 40 cycles. 40 cycles, alright. And I got all my all my skins for the week. Yeah, thanks for hanging out, guys. It was fun. Appreciate the advice as well. I expect I'll I'll see a bunch of your messages in the Discord telling me things that I should be doing better. And it's good. I like to see it. I feel like I it's hard for me to really digest advice that I get given on stream because I need time to like absorb it and think about it so if you send like pictures and diagrams and stuff that helps i can kind of understand it in my own time i have but a small brain <laughs> um but yeah that's all thank you guys very much i will catch you tomorrow enjoy the rest of your evening take care